Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. And today I have some thrilling news for all the tech enthusiasts and aspiring developers. So Amazon is back with the fifth season of its premiere hackathon, Hackathon with Amazon. And let's dive into the what this exciting event has in store for you. So, but before getting into the video, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then subscribe now and also join in our WhatsApp and Telegram groups for more interesting internships and job opportunities for all the batches. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram and LinkedIn page. So let's get into this video. Hackathon with Amazon is an annual hackathon hosted by the Amazon and is aiming to foster innovation and the problem solving among building tech minds. So it's a platform where you can showcase your coding prowess and the collaborate with the like-minded individuals and potentially catch the eye of Amazon recruiters. This is a very good opportunity. Uh, let's see who are eligible for this hackathon and what are the uh, eligible institutes are eligible for this hackathon. So registration has been already started and the eligibility if you see who are graduating in the year 2026 and 2027 it means currently second year and third years are eligible for this hackathon and also they provided the some institutes which are eligible for this hackathon so you can just see this list nearly one uh, like uh, one or five institutes has been listed here so you can see here and if you are eligible then you can apply for this and also the team members in a team can also be different institutes or year of graduation and the specialization or the different courses so it is mandatory the team team leader has to be from this listed institute and the team members can also be from the different institutes or different uh, universities or different year of graduation nothing but they can be from like final year or the first year and they can be from different uh, specializations uh, from different branches but team leader has to be of uh, from these eligible institutes only so graduation year obviously uh, third year and uh, second years are eligible and next the degrees are also given here it can be from any of the branches they provide either it can be from computer science or the IT or the electronics or the electrical and then other affiliated branches and also 6.5 CGPA and above through it under graduation. So CGPA, CGPA has to be must must be greater than 6.5 and also the team member must be consisting of 2 to 4 members. So minimum of 2 members and a maximum of 4 members. So individual participation is not allowed here. And next also participation is participant is required to collaborate with a minimum of one participant or to form a team and also can be from the participant members of one team only and each of the team members has to be individually eligible as per the criteria mentioned to move to the coding challenge stage and also note that CGPA details are mandatory for all the participating team members so let's uh, see the competition structure of this hackathon First, we will be having the coding round. So, before this coding round, they will be checking the uh, registered participants. So, if you are uh, if you are meeting the eligibility criteria, then you will be shortlisted. You will be moved to the next round. Otherwise, who are failing to meet the eligibility criteria, they will not be able to continue the uh, coding challenge. So, after the shortlisted over are selected, uh, who are meeting the eligibility criteria, they will be moving on to the coding round. So, in this the all the team eligible teams has to attempt this coding round and in this coding round you'll be having the 30 minutes and you need to solve the three coding questions along with some mcqs so some mcqs will also be provided like 10 to 15 or 5 and three coding questions will be there you need to solve it in 100 minutes nothing but one hour 20 minutes and the number has to attempt this coding round individually so they will be evaluating uh, you will be eligible to the next round uh, like by evaluating your uh, score and your participant score every like every team member uh, and with the team leader so total team uh, how much you have scored and so everything they will be evaluating and then you will be qualified to the next round next round is the idea submission and all the shortlisted teams as to where all the members have cleared the coding round so they have to submit an idea which is related to the themes. 
some some things will be provided or oh, which are related to the real world business problems which are faced by the amazon so you need to create you have to you need to submit the idea based on the themes and you will be able to download the submission template so this coding challenge will be happening on the 29th may from 12 pm to 9 pm and this is results will be short uh, will be shared very soon as they mentioned here the id submission will be from 31 to may, uh, 31 may to 9 june so you will be getting the results on 30th of may or the 31 30 or 31 of the may so once you have shortlisted then you will be seeing the uh, button here in the idea submission and after this time you will be having the prototype submission so you have to the shortlisted teams will be required to make the prototypes of their idea submitted in the idea submission phase and also you need to interact and virtually present those prototypes to the amazon tech leaders and this will be happening virtually this will be happening from the 13th of june to 22nd of july next after this whoever are shortlisted the top eight teams they will be uh, getting their dedi um, dedicated mentorships from the top mentors and also they will help you to prepare the more effectively for the grand finale so this mentorship is very designed to provide the strategic guidance and to refine more ideas and to enhance the presentation skills and ensuring the teams are well occupied for the final stage so the top eight teams will be getting uh, this mentorship and this will be happening from the 25th of june to 28th of july and next finally the grand finale will be happening so that is on from to, uh, 2nd july to 2nd july so here you need to uh, you know uh, prototype submission phase you will get an opportunity to go through the mentorship program with the amazon tech leaders and on the grand finale day whoever are shortlisted those has to present their ideas to the jury members and various teams of amazon like uh, amazon web services or the alexa amazon bing and some other affiliated and then the grand finale will be held virtually so this will be happening on 2nd july to 2nd july from 10 am to the 4 pm and also the given here as 22nd july but it is not 22nd july it is 22nd june so this is all what you need to know about this and also prepare for it and coming to the rewards so first winner will be getting the 1 lakh and also getting an opportunity to experience a day at amazon and the first runner up will be getting 75000 second runner up will be getting 50000 and the mentorship will be given for the top 8 teams as they mentioned here so mentorship from the top 8 teams the top 8 teams and then swags for the top 8 teams so these are the reward rewards so if you have any doubts let me know in the comment section so you can also see some faqs which are related to this you you should not uh, you cannot participate individually your team must consist of two to four members and then there is no registration fee so whoever are eligible like whatever the institutes uh, they have provided here so those candidates are only eligible for this hackathon and also regarding assessment round they given uh, like uh, like some faqs if you are you can just go with all this and also uh, if you have any doubts let me know in the coming section so don't miss the opportunity to challenge yourself and grow professionally so register now and start preparing and also if you need the previous year questions for this hackathon to prepare for this uh, like for the coding round or for the idea submission round So let me know in the comments. Definitely, I'll make a clear video and the clear document on how to prepare for this hackathon and how to crack the coding assessment. So definitely, I'll be providing all the resources along with the previous year questions. So let me know in the comment section and also share this video with your friends. If you have any doubts, let me know in the comment section and also join in our WhatsApp, Telegram, and the follow us on LinkedIn and Instagram pages for more interesting updates on internships and job opportunities. Thank you.